Hello everyone. Today we will be discussing about programmatic SEO. Now the thing is, what exactly is programmatic SEO? So the first thing which comes into your mind is that this is some kind of automation, and the answer is yes. So programmatic SEO basically means to uh, perform SEO in such a way so that you can create dynamic landing pages and the SEO operation can be dynamic so that you, this can save a lot of hours and this can really smoothen the entire SEO journey. Now the question is where this would be finding the most use cases. So as you can see from the screen like if you uh, like if you're trying to optimize for a certain uh, things maybe on Washington and in New York so and for maybe selected n number of cities or lists such as travel guides in Washington, travel guides in New York, travel guides in Phoenix, travel guides in n different places. So this is a perfect example where programmatic SEO can come into the play because uh, your landing page structure can be same, your content details can be same, your your like like mostly all of the cities falls under the United States. So pretty obvious that the culture. Uh, the foods ev like everything would be having a similar intent it's only the different places which really makes up the difference now how to segregate the things up uh, the first thing is that you need to first understand what is the exact orientation of the keyword where you need to perform the programmatic SEO for for example if you're having a travel blog then first check the Google trend of travel guides best travel guides or travel guidelines travel best practices you you need to first phrase a common term like travel guides and once you phrase the common term then you need to list down all the cities or the target locations where you want your SEO to reach out to the audiences and then create an excel parameter list down all of your main modifier keywords along with the differentiators for example travel guides best watches so these are all the common terms which will be common for all of the places and then you you need to put all the cities all together and then it's time to build the right and dynamic landing pages so you can just draft one important content and you need to just re-alter the metadata and the location so you can use various plugins for that or uh, as you can see some of the name of the plugins I, am, I have shown on the screen but you can also go to your developer and do some dynamic coding where your URL structure would be running using a syntax such as if someone loads the page example.com travel guides then a particular location and this will keep on repeating for all of the landing pages make sure to use a canonical for all of the pages just so that this does not lead to a duplicate issue and this is yet a simple and effective measure specifically if you're running some blogging websites or if you're uh, like targeting same intent oriented content to a wide range of audiences across multiple locations i hope this video is useful thanks for watching